Wait, Shuffle, keep your balance. That's it, keep it up. Come on, work. You'll make a fool of yourself. Piss off, I'm a coach for Christ's sake. You out. Come on, man, that's all I've got. You're always broke. Four weeks, I want it all, or you're out. What about the people who rely on this place? It's emotional, man. We're businessmen. We charge fees. The government charged me land tax. I up your rent, you charge your little fee. Everybody's happy. These people can't afford it. That's why you're broke. See ya. Oh, people need this place. Come on, man. Go oh, on. Oh. I'm not going to do me that easy, man, I can tell you. <laughs> right, no, the best two for last. <laughs> oh, you know. Oh, you know. Oh, you know. This one, I got when I was 19 and angry. <laughs> What's that in the middle? Uh, it's a harp. I got it off a Guinness can. Bloody Irish. <laughs> <laughs> As always. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me? Hello? Oh, hey, Dad. Yeah? yeah? Hey, what do you want? Yeah. What? <laughs> hey, can you, like, just keep it down for a minute? Yeah, yeah, go on. Yeah, I said a little something for your birthday. I'll give it to you when I see you next. No. No, I don't know, hey. Come on, mate. Ease up a bit. Now keep your money up. I don't need anything. Oh, Jake, mate, come on. That I've got people here? Hey, where's the waiter? <laughs> Look, I, I gotta go, okay? I'll see you later. And then his dad whacked him one. <laughs> I was just telling him how you went a bit deaf in one ear. Yeah. Uh, hello? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I've told you before, okay? We weren't brawling, we were sparring. Mm, is that what you call it? Jesus, Amy. Look, my father may be a loser who gives me the shits. Even I'll agree with that. But he's not... Look, he's still my father. Okay? Tom. The wine? You know what your problem is? You don't do as you're told. Oi! Not finished with you. You need to learn how to defend yourself. That's my gym. Listen, old boy, I've got a uh, proposition. No. Oh, Steve, it's a chance for us both to make some money. Steve? Well, how the hell do you intend keeping Mullins off your back, eh? Oh, just... Come on!
What are you still doing here? What's that for? You all right, mate? What's going on? What's all this? You stupid cow! Oh, relax. Don't freak out. This is just exactly what we talked about. Look, I moved out of home this morning, okay? For good, and I'm not going back. I just thought you moved back in. You're right. Look, it was a bad move, okay? Look, Steve, the truth is my mum couldn't care less about me, okay? And my dad's as weak as piss. So at the end of the day, you're on your own in this fucked up world, okay? No, you're not. Yeah? Well, I am, tonight. So it's all cash, there's no credit cards? Or... Uh, once in a while, you yeah. know. Okay? Okay. Yeah. You, you'll be fine. Yeah. You'll be fine. Okay, now, when we get over a thousand dollars, we take it and we put it down here in the safe. Okay? What's in the container? Oh, that's Mullen's stuff. Don't touch it. Mullen's? But doesn't he own the gym? Oh, he owns lots of things. Look, I'm running late. I gotta go. You'll be back at 1 a.m., right? I said I would. You'll be okay. fine. Bye. Bye. You know what? I've never seen you with a woman. Not likely to. Is that right? Who's that Julie chick then? Uh, her? No, no, she's just an old friend of my wife's. Uh, she came on a bit strong when uh, Noah and I looked like splitting up. And did you? Oh, sort of. Uh, Noah took uh, Jason back to Ireland for for many years when he was very young. <sighs> Tore my heart out. Uh, here, here, come on. There you go. Look, I'm sure the first time must seem uh, challenging. Uh, can you just wait a sec, I'll be back. All right, I'll piss in your boots and that's all. Can I have a look? Ouch! I thought I told you to sit down. I know, but I'm here to save souls. Oh, okay, okay. Hey. What? Cost you 20. Hey. What? Now? The hair, right? What? You piss it off. You see boxes with hair like that? You cut yeah. it back. Do something with it. Whatever. Hit your guard up, eh? You're gonna get your head knocked off. Right. All right. More balance with your feet. Put them more forward. Come on. That's the same combination you taught Jason. Yeah, but she's got fire in her belly. Get over it, Steve. She's looking good, though. Can't say the same for you. Who cares? Hmm. So, when are you moving in? I'll see. Maybe this week. Great. But the stuff of your mum's is going to have to go. These photos. Not really our century, huh? And you shouldn't stash cash at home. I've told you before. Oh. Yeah. Driving myself, huh? Mm-hmm. The only way you get a loan that size is if you extend the mortgage. Oops. Can't do. 
you're already pushed to the limit. Well, as you don't have any other capital, you should consider selling up. She has to find a new trainer. Maybe we should do a deal. Oh, this'll be all right. Look, uh, you get around, you're into a lot of stuff. Uh, maybe you, sh you should put up some dough as an investment for the for the coming title. You know, you, d you get a percentage, uh, plus some more. Oh, and a bit more. Uh, hello, you know, it's a state title. You know, like it's big media coverage. No, nah, not for us. Well, yeah, but TV rights as well. Sound like a man on the skids. Come on! Come on, what was that? How about a hundred a week on a regular basis? Say, three nights a week. 175. 150 and that's it. I'll need some flexibility with times next semester. Good for you. Your mother would have been proud. giving her? What do you mean, what am I giving her? What are you trying to be funny? Uh, no, no, I just meant supplements. Uh, look, apart from a nasty dose of the flu, there's an indication of amphetamines. Regular little pill popper. No, 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 I've had a long talk with her about that. Apparently, it wasn't loud enough. It smells like duramine. It's an appetite suppressant. Works like speed. Sorry, Steve, I caved in. Yeah, you've bitten off more than you can chew. Maybe we both have. Maybe we should give the whole thing a miss. Please keep it down. No, Steve, we've got to keep going. Look, we're a team. With you helping me, I can get through this. Please, I promise I won't take any more. We agree. Tell the truth and look at you. Is this shit addictive? You're a good man. Pity about my age, right? We'll see. Yo, it's Herc. Put your boss on.
Good day. Hey. You've um, you got the place looking pretty good. Cheers. Stainless steel, eh? Pretty schmick. Mm-hmm. Look, um. Thanks for the leg up, okay? You fucking are as well? Whoa, uh, hang on, there's a double bed in there. We're lucky to get it until we find another place. Are you gonna do that? You can't even pay rent. Who says I can't pay rent? I heard. Okay, I own up. What about you? You're cashed up. Uh, why don't you invest some money to get us over the hump? I'm ready, Raymond. You'll get it back after the fight. Look, the answer's no, okay? You know, I've got my own plans now. Like getting the bank off my ass. Oh, I hope you're, you're stuck. Are you deaf? N-O. You know, how am I supposed to make my way if I'm all the time fucking up at your shit? Hey! Hey! Noisy bastards. So this is what all the fuss is about. So, Georgie, you go back to bed. I'm sorry about the noise, okay? Hey, hang on. What? What about a temperature, huh? What about? I'll let you know what's going on. Give us a second. Hey, hang on. Hey, I'm looking up. Just give that a miss. Oh, well, sorry, Mr. Fucking Expert. Jesus. Look, I'm asking for her, too. All right, what about we sell the house and I take my share? What do you think about that? What do you mean, sell the house? There is no your share. Don't you get it? Look around you, this is my house now. You were out a long time ago. Well, thanks a lot. What's this cashed up shit? Okay, it's taken me three years to save up for this sports management stuff. Listen, you're a boxer, not a netball coach. What is that team? The daffodils. Get real! Oh, shut up! Hey! Shut up, it's both of you! Come on, mate. You know, we'll get the gym going again. They were great days. No. I'm not gonna prop you up anymore. You better believe it. You don't know how it twists a man guts to, to come cap in hand to his own son. You don't know kids, do you? <laughs> None that I know of, mate. Knocked back by my own son. I spent years down here training and never asked for a cent. I tell you, in a couple of weeks, it's the end of the line, pal. Everything we've worked for, you know the rest. Ah, oh, Steve, dear boy. Can I offer you a lift? Perhaps have a bit of a chat. Jake, lock up, mate. You're telling me you want to hit the Abbey? Jason just scored a job there, Julie manages the place. Hello? Mullins is always bragging about how much he pulls in. Saturday night. You have no shame. You would never have any thought about the fallout. You amaze me. There'll be no fallout. You need the money, I need the money. One third, two thirds. You drive the car, I do the nasty bit. No, no one's going to get hurt. Well, maybe a little, little bit of a mess. Mess? What sort of mess? Well, the safe. I mean, a bit of Semtex in the wee small hours. Look, it'll take about five minutes, no one will know who, and then we simply fade away into the night. It's just the money for all your plans. All you have to do is sit in the car for a few minutes and drive off. You do it yourself. Steve, I need someone to act as lookout and to drive me out of here at a rapid rate of knots. I hate this, I hate what you're saying. Steve, desperate situations? Hmm? I'll think about it, all right? And no weapons. No weapons, no sticks, no stones. It's either them or me, you understand? Look, you guys, 
Whatever you're gonna do about accommodation, just do it, okay? ASAP. You're kicking us out already. Look, she'll walk out on me, all right? Yeah, she's a plumber. Why is it that you torpedo every chick I get involved with, huh? Her type rule with the power of the pussy. Behave, you get some. If not, you miss out. And that, my dear, nice son can go on forever. Oh, that's fucking rubbish. Oh, Steve, do you have to get the baby? Uh, Jason. Look, uh, I'm sorry, I've, I've gone too far. Sometimes I, I worry about stuff. You know, when you're in training, yeah, women can get in the way. Well, I'm not training anymore. You know, just in case you forgot. Yeah, okay, sometimes I, I do forget. Yeah. Mate. This may be the wrong time, but uh, this is the, uh, the birthday item that I, I, I spoke to you about. I said I didn't want anything. Oh, Jason. Stay out of this. I mean, in there is uh, the sort of woman that any man would be proud to have as their, as their partner. I've got to go to work, and uh, I'm staying at Amy's tonight, okay? I've got to do some crawling. driving uh, with the semi side swipes. I should have been driving, but I was too pissed. Jesus. This sounds like my kind of shit. And, uh, oh, and thanks for, you know. Whoa, uh, <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe I, <clears throat> maybe I should, um, get some, uh, something on the, some oats on. Good morning. You know, that is very, very flattering, but we mustn't forget you, you care, all right? You care, don't you? This is different. Come on, George, you know I fancy. I mean, 
any normal bloke would. Look, I just want to thank you. For caring for me. When nobody else would. You know, I, I don't know, I just... Hey, just relax, okay? Stop bleeding. I just feel good around you, that's all. Yeah, well, that means a lot to me. Hopes are fine, Steve. Just relax. That must be crazy. Oh, well, thanks. No, no, not you. I've just got a lot of things going on at the moment. It feels like all my chickens are coming home to roost. Well, isn't that good? No, not if they're going to kick my shit ass down, no. And now, my beautiful girl, time for a final <laughs> blessing. Oh, look, thanks for the champagne supper. I'm not used to being so sober. Look, don't, don't be silly. Look, come on, just prepare yourself. No, 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 stop it. Someone what? might see us. Uh, oh, yeah. At three o'clock in the morning? Oh, look at her. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, check this out. No, stop. Come on, dear, let's get the fuck out of here! Now uh, listen, you must relinquish your wrongdoing. I'm mad! Oh, oh, oh. Repent! Repent! No! You're gonna fuck things up so badly. Oh, for God's sake, will you stop going on about it? Come on, you fucking gun freak! Let's split this door and let's get out of here! What do you mean, gun freak? I can't give the guy a break. Seats burnt. Neat job. Looks like an inside job. That's the mark. I said I was just at a fancy dress party, all right? Just a simple fancy all right. dress all right. party. You say there's an ugly blonde at the wheel and the one with the gun. Yeah. Yeah, the one with the gun. What did he look like? Oh, thank the Lord for morphine. The one with the gun. What did he look like? Well, Caucasian, all right. Hey, what are you doing? Taken... Go and wait in the car. Don't you need me as a witness? I said wait in the car. But what about the procedure? Wait in the fucking car! Don't be prick. Right, next. Accent. Wouldn't happen to be a bit... Pommy, would he? How did you work that out? Oh, years of experience. And uh, no other witnesses? Witnesses? 
No, no, no other witnesses, no, not at all. Right, right, then when you listen to me, you fake. We'll need a formal statement and your prints. I'm gonna go through all the events from when you pulled up in the car to when you took a shot in the foot. And I'm gonna go away and write the report, bring it back tomorrow for you to sign. Nice and simple. Oh, yeah, all right. And what's this no fixed abode? What, no family? No, I guess weirdos like you live alone, eh? Rather be someone else? Tonight you're a priest. Tomorrow, what? Peter fucking Pan? I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, nurse. I've aided and abetted stealing 20 grand on the side with a deadly weapon. What have I done? You've got to realise there wouldn't be any of this money if it wasn't for this. This has got us into the deep shit, mate. Ah, uh, yes, but... This gets people to do things they wouldn't normally do. I mean, look at it, Steve. It's beautiful. Go on. Feel the power. I want to bury the bloody thing! Hey, get out, man! Oh! <laughs> That's training for you. Ah, uh, lucky I was smart enough to remove the bullets from the chambers first. Yeah, but you weren't smart enough to lock the door. <laughs> Cut that out! Get out! Stick him in the front. Hey, you registered that at the station, all right? It's a law. Your mate here is on parole with stolen money, an unlicensed firearm, and a bloke in hostel with a fucking pole in his foot. You telling me about the law? Fucking bullshit to me. Take his statement. I'll be back in an hour, right? An hour? But aren't we arresting them both? Trust me. We've got to keep them apart. No collaboration. Yes, sir. Keep them here for an hour, then we'll flick them. You really fucked up this one, eh? The good news is, there's enough here for what you owe me. Total cocker. There's one other small thing. Ah, uh, you've been paid out. That's it. But as the gun will put this job into the papers, whom am I to arrest? You? Not me, old son. You know they'll throw the book at you this time. It wasn't me. I didn't do it. Oh, and how's that, pray tell? Because you're going to find Steve's fingerprints all over the gun. <laughs> With friends like you, who needs enemies? Chickens kick your shit house down. On oh, that. That sure looks like it. Fuck you up, too. Hey! It's amazing. It's this. All these people have respect for me now, you know? They make me feel important. I mean, this is power. Hey, listen, dickhead. Look at me. This is fucking power. Oh. So pull your fucking head in, right? You know who else has got power? Oh, tell me. That mobster you ID'd. Mate, he's got contacts that go everywhere. So you're gonna have to disappear until I get him convicted, right? Or do I get police protection? I mean, where is this freak, you know? Oh, he's under surveillance. Don't you worry about that. Until we get that conviction. So to make it all happen, you sign this. OK, well, where's the pen? No, no, slow down. I'm obliged to tell you what you're about to sign here. Oh, here we go. So the story is, the woman at the wheel was actually a man with a wig on. You didn't get a good look at him because it was so dark, right? He told you to piss off, and you didn't. So he shot you in the foot, correct? 
So in return for you signing this and disappearing until you hear from me, you'll get to live. Would that interest you? Well, come on, let's go. Witness to a signature, please, nurse. Everybody behaving themselves here? Yes, sir. Mr. Kohler is offering his complete cooperation. <laughs> I bet he is. And I want the fact that I cooperated recorded. Oh, do you? Sit down. You may like to know that the priest has just admitted that it was a one-man show. How about that? Sister good. Sir. Sir, the evidence suggests that there were two people at the scene of the crime. Don't worry. I confessed to the whole thing. Why the hell would you do that? But sir, listen to me. Look, we've got a getaway car. We've got two sets of footprints. Sir! It just feels like a two-man job that... Sir, listen to me. What about, uh, what about the money? Well, that's confiscated, of course. I don't know, uh, for a bloke with handcuffs on you, looking pretty cool. Yeah, you spread them. You spread them for me. Please, Bert. No wonder they call you the smoke. Hiding a weapon, huh? Something I might be interested in. No, don't try anything, stupid punk. <laughs> These are the only weapons I need. <laughs> Stupid bimbo, get up there! Feel what you really got. Oh, that's nice. Oh, oh. Nobody touches me there unless I say so. You understand? Assaulting a police officer? Huh? Yeah, so? Who's gonna believe you? You're fucking gone, girl. Go on, tell him. I dare you. Better watch your back, girlie. They still here. I thought I told you to get rid of them. Now listen. Until the lab report comes back, we don't know anything. So stop farting about. Get them out of here. Especially that pompous prick. <laughs> Pills, pop, pop, pop. <laughs> what the fuck are you on about? Let me tell you something. I happen to know she's sick as a dog, out of condition, and doing speed. Now that's crap. She's on her way out, man. Forget it. The deal's off. She just knocked down a copper twice her weight and strength. The answer's no. She's a loser. Just like that. Just like that. What do you ask me down here for? Just to rub my nose in them? No, just to thank you. Well, thank me for what? The robbery. Yeah, but the fight fee can be paid on the night, Carter. All right, uh, all right, Monday, okay, okay. Thanks very much. Thank you. 
Oh, I, no. No, I don't think so. I won't be able to do it, no. Okay, I'll get back to you. You still here? Well, good morning, Amy. How nice to see you. Still paying for those phone calls? You can tell Jason I'm not moving in anymore. Why is that? Because I'm moving out. Well, hang on, you're telling yourself. You do your own dirty work. And that includes two months in advance, so I don't expect any further harassment. <laughs> hmm. So which old lady's bag did you steal that money from? You know, I've been meaning to ask you, how did you get the money to pay for everything? Uh, a loan from Jason. Really? Huh. Yeah. That's good of him. Yeah, that's, that's good. You know, uh, I've been meaning to ask you, um, maybe we, uh, we, can get a, we can get a place together. What do you say? I say I've hit the jackpot. Amy, uh, was pissed off about us still being there, so, uh, she's moved back out again. I don't know. You meddling old bastard. And we are going to find a place of our own. Yeah, right. I'll oh, take exception to the old. Yeah, I'll oh, half fucking half. Uh, there's something else. What's that? I borrowed some, uh, some cash. Uh, Later, okay. Sort Just of. Leave me alone. A robbery! Not a robbery! Jason! What? You lent him the money, didn't you? What? What? Where have you been? He's what? still my father! Well, what a laugh that was. Why don't you shut your mouth before I shut it permanently? Oi! Hey! None of that. Jason! I'm then. gonna pay you back, mate! 17 Loftus Street. Hurry! Sports manager, huh? You couldn't manage a fuck in a brothel, Jason. Oh, thanks very much. Yeah, well, look how you turned out, darling. Uh, Jason! You get paid back from the fight, mate. It's just six weeks. Six weeks? My uni fees are due now, you hear me? Now! They're coming to get you, you old fart. And they may as well lock up that rooting machine. Like what you call it. me? Rooting machine. Slut. Yeah? Let's see if netballers can fight then, huh? Hey, touch her and I swear. Cut it out. What's going on? I mean, you don't have Well, well, well. What have we here? Piss off, this I is mean, a domestic, all right? Domestic. Sounds more like the Middle East. Jason, don't dob him in. He's your father. That's right. He robbed me of six grand. Peanuts. Forget it. You, Stephen Arthur Collar, are being arrested. <laughs> Good on you, mate. Yeah, we're occasioning you grievous bodily harm upon James Martin Collier oh. with an unlicensed firearm. When did you get a gun? On the night of January. Sir. Sir. What? You said I could charge him. This one's mine. On January the 10th at Dad? approximately 2.58. Go on your choice, go on your choice. You can say anything you like, but what you what do say happen? may be oh, used as evidence what? against you in a court. Oh, do you oh, understand? Yes, I no, I Hey, no. don't touch it. Dad? Do you understand? I mean, I understand. What? Hey, what? Tell me, shut the fuck up. This is a promise. Charge sheet, sir. You read that? This is the lab report confirming that the prints on the weapon match the accused fingerprints. This is his statement, which says that he was driving the getaway vehicle. Denies all other charges. You still deny these charges, Mr. Kohler? Bloody oath I do. 
Shooting of a witness with an unlicensed firearm. What's this? Diamonds valued at half a million dollars. I just drove the car. What's going on? Diamonds? Well, where they went to is still what interests us and the insurance company. Are you applying for bail? Forget about damn bail. I've been set up. I just drove the goddamn car. I told her no weapons. And what does he do? And where is he today? You tell me that. Sit down, Mr. with a woman known to us. It's been checked out, sir. What's he saying? What the hell is he saying? All right, bail's refused. Take him to the custody sergeant. Arrange for his court appearance Monday morning. What is going on? You can apply for bail to the magistrate, Mr. Kohler. That's the procedure in these matters. And this is bullshit! How does a man get clobbered for something he didn't do? I've been set up. I just drive the goddamn car. In the light of the seriousness of this alleged offence and the fact that you have no permanent residence... Your Honour, there are certain people with a vested interest in incriminating me. I keep on telling my so-called lawyer this... If you interrupt again, Mr. Kohler, I'll hold you in contempt. Come on, say something. Uh... Your Honour. In support of my client's bail application, I would further like to say that, that I have nothing further to add, Your Honour. You pay nothing, you get nothing. It's just not right. When deciding bail, I have to consider the safety of the community and the victim. Your Honour. No! Your Honour, that is not right! Mr. Kohler. I hereby refuse bail. This matter is adjourned. That's not right. I just drove the car. That's all, I Mr. Kohler. I mean, set up. I was driving the car. How could you be so stupid? He says the priest is his only witness. What was the priest doing outside the Abbey at 3 o'clock in the morning? Well, where the hell was the priest? Why wasn't he in the courtroom? No idea. Trust you. That's Arizona for. Dad reckons you did the job, he just drove. Well, of course he'd tell you that. I mean, do you think that I would rob my own landlord of a well-connected thug I like you Mullins? I mean, who the hell would be so stupid? Are you calling my dad a liar? Listen, I understand how upset must be. Don't touch me. But, but wasn't it Steve who was this desperate quest for money recently? I mean, are you absolutely sure that he's been totally honest with you? Is there anything he hasn't told you? Now, I, on the other hand, have an impeccable alibi. I mean, just oh, ask dude. the police. Oh, that's crap. The police, oh, they weren't even there. there. How are they supposed to know anything? It was you on, and Steve. Oh, I, do. I do not deserve your suspicions. Oh. I mean, it's most hurtful. Uh, yes, ladies, hello. Yes, I'll be with you shortly. Listen, if I can help you with anything in the future, you just let me know. In the meantime, excuse me. Look, Jason. I'm not sorry about that bitch, Amy. But if you want me to move out, I understand. No. You should stay. Your dad's woman, aren't you? I haven't seen him so happy in years. OK, look, this is how I reckon it should go. If I'm going to stand a chance making any of my money back, then I'm taking over training and management. If no one has a better suggestion. Look, now if everyone's prepared to take the gamble, I'm willing to give it my best shot. What do you say? Jake? As you said, it's your money. 
What? Punishment time for me, huh? Hey, this is way above being petty, okay? We need you to fight, and fight to win. Anyway, look, it's about managing the situation, right? Okay, fine. But didn't I hear your sweetheart say that you couldn't even manage a fuck in a brothel? Excuse me, he can manage a fuck in a brothel a lot better than I can, and I'm running the place. So that means you're back in the game, huh? Bet. Alright, if he stays banged up, he can take over his area, but not before. And another thing, my rocks, are they safe? Your diamonds are perfectly safe for now. To be sold on soon, I trust, just in time for my uh, dividends for my troubles. You'll get paid. And let's not forget my percentage of the insurance payout, will we? What's this shit? I've got the munchies. <sighs> Jesus. Hey, you know what? I really like your mum's stuff. Do you mind if I put some back up? What, you want to? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. Huh? Just stop eating that sugary crap, OK? Okay, it's one of them pills. I was throwing them out. You think I was doing them behind your back? Yes, I do. Listen, Jason, without a word of a lie, you'd be proud of me. I flushed them down the toilet. You flushed them down your neck? What the fuck do you think you're doing, George? I can't fucking believe this. Are you a loser or what? Hey, hey, you must believe me, okay? I was throwing them out, every single one. Everyone except this one. Yeah, right. What, you don't believe me? No, I don't believe you. You don't fucking believe no. me! Oh, this is bullshit! Fuck! If you don't believe me, then I will! Nobody believes me, I'm stupid! Hey, it's stop! Not Jesus! Me. Hey! Is that it? Stop! Go Just on. stop! Hang huh? up! Come on! Hit me! Why? Oh. oh, shit. Look, I'm sorry. Just. Oh, shit! Come here, give me yeah. a look! Oh, oh. Come here, come here. Come on, sit down. Sit. Leave a look. Oh, oh. Stop. Oh, Jesus. Ice, ice. Oh. Come on. Oh, what have I done? What have I fucking done? Oh. No, Jason, it's not all your fault. You want to win something too. You can't help being a sport brat though. Can you? Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's caramel, see? Ah. Yeah. What's up? Nothing. You got a soft touch. Let's uh, keep it professional, okay? Let's see how you go, okay? Come on. Mm. Try to left. Come on. Mm -hmm. All right, look, no more. No more. Get him off. Go on. Look, she hurt her hand a bit, all right? Doesn't usually happen when you're hitting... Jay, I punched a wall, okay? Where's George? Oh, she doesn't know I'm here. I didn't want any distractions, okay? What do you mean, distractions? Jesus, Dad, I'm not your little boy anymore, okay? 
You know, why you always treat me like I'm fucking stupid or something? You just need to lighten up a bit. Maybe spend a couple of weeks in here. Look, I need you to have a word with Herc. He owes me an explanation. Owes you more than an explanation? What, you know something I don't know? No, no more than you. Just the evidence in court. It's driving me crazy. Okay, look. If you're not lying, then you've been stitched up. Stitched up and flushed down the toilet. So what uh, did you want to ask me about? Okay, look. I've taken over training George. That's what I came here to tell you. Okay, and before we start arguing, I'm trying to win my money back so we can pay some more to get you out of here. Okay, any objections? Dad! Dad! Dad, come on! Jesus, Dad! Uh, uh, lights out, isn't it? What? It's a bit early, don't you think? No, it's not. Did you get a letter, huh? Yes. And he says to tell you he's sorry for stuffing things up. Yeah, it'd be nice if you said that to my face. It's called pride? Words like that don't come easy to guys like him. Or most men. Okay, look, I'm at the Abbey tonight, so... Let's have lights out now, please. So you're having fun? Fun? Yeah, dealing with all those wild chicks. Hey, it's money, okay? They're professional, so am I. You're the only wild chick I'm dealing with. And don't turn the lights back on when I'm gone. You kill yourself doing double shifts. Winners never quit. Quitters never win. It's Jessie. It's Jessie. She's in ten. She's in her tent. She's with that. She's with that freaky guy. Stay so here. Wait. Wait. Oh, my God. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Shut up. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Oh, back at these. I'm going back to the bush. I'm sorry. It's just the you shut up. You get the fuck what? out of here and don't you ever come back, okay? Jessie, wait a sec. Get stuck. Jessie. You wait right here. I want a word with you. Jessie. Hey, Roger. Hey, I know your name. Take a look. Now, in here, I got bruising, rope burns. I reckon you know the kind of shit you're in for with this kind of psycho stuff. And what that'll do to your reputation. True? Get to the point. Better than the last one. <laughs> Look, there's something I need to talk to you about. Um, I don't know how I forgot this. I should be, should be bullwhip, but there was this Sheila. She was already in, in the priest's car. What car? On the other side of the fucking road. They arrived for some action after Herc went in, so she must have seen something. She must have. Maybe it was one of Julie's girls. That's it, last Julie. Yeah. Will you do that for me? 
Sure. So, you're going here with the fight? Yeah, for sure. She's on top of it, mate. Yep. No drugs. New routines. Yeah, yeah, you know, road exactly. work, really good diet, high protein intake too, so. Oh, really good protein intake. Whoa. What about a temperature? You're taking that as well? Hey, just good ideas, okay? What ideas? What sort of good ideas? Like calling the cops? That sort of good idea, is it? Hey, listen, you put yourself in here, okay? It has nothing to do with me. So you still think I did the whole thing? Hey, I never said you did yeah. anything yeah. about yeah. it. I can see it in your face. Look, Look at this attitude the whole time. The attitude. Hey, Chris, stop it. 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 Calm down. I can stay there then. Shadows on the floor, shadows on the wall Like doubts that weigh my heart Living with the sound of a battleground Oh, shadows from the past Through the give and take and in spite of the war Those doubts turned to survival And the way it went, the time was spent and I became the rival Of, uh, a couple of mugs uh, caught me by surprise. Oh. What happens, you know, pecking all the stuff. You uh, look like you've got something niggling at you. Maybe. You want to get it off your chest? I understand why you stood me up. After Nola died? I meant no disrespect at all. No, no. I just overreacted. I said, it was a difficult time, you know, with him pulling out of boxing. I was only trying to help. I know, I know. Like all those courage you put my way. It must have looked like skin and bone, did I? Mm. Good on you, Jules. Well, I still make curries. When you get out of here, if you want to come over, I'll um, put your name in the pot. George, is it true? <sighs> Impeccable timing. Oh, no! Strike, then pull your guard up. See? Oh, oh, this is bullshit. Oh, yeah? You know what your problem is? You don't do as you're told. Champion, this champion will pay her back with interest. 
before she gets real down and dirty. <laughs> Round one action. Uh, just probing each other out. <laughs> Typical first round, I'd call it even. I didn't want to come in the first place. We're here I to totally support. I agree with your attitude and I think it's the wrong thing for her to We're do. here to support our daughter. You got it. You just gotta remember the one turn left and right. Look at me, focus. Left and right, left Listen. and right. Where's Steve Kohler? Who is this guy in the corner? Show that we love her, that we care for her. That's why we're sitting here. Oh, Look at the fire in those eyes. Come on! Big shots from the champ, and the unknown <laughs> challenger responds as she tries to hang on. <laughs> Georgina working upstairs, a left hook. And now, straight right hands, Georgina Bettina really going to work in this second round. <laughs> the champion standing toe to toe. The girls at close quarter. And uh, Georgina Bettina now delivering <laughs> underneath and over the top. <laughs> Big left hook, and the champ goes down. The champ goes down. Give me that. Third and final round, ladies and gentlemen. As I said before, look out, buckle up. She's got to take control right here where the title goes. <laughs> Georgina lets a couple of punches go, but the champion is really going to work. Flurries, punches in bunches for the champion, Solitaire Estelle. Georgina, Jesus, wow. Nobody calls me Georgina. I do. I mean, you were just beautiful tonight. Beautiful in every way.
time I opened your eyes. I have a precious jewel. I better tell you about it. This has got to stay between you and me. I'm telling you now, I won't take bribes. I won't sink down to your level. I want you to understand why I cut corners, bend the rules, why I risk so much. This is my jewel, little Holly. She's had seven operations in her short life. Do you think I can afford that on what they pay me? Well, do you, you self-righteous little prick? Still doesn't make it right. Well, it sure does to me, mate. And what's she gonna do when they lock you up? Congratulations, I'm proud of you. Thanks. When are you gonna visit me alone? Soon. Good news. This Friday, two most important words. You're on. Right, about time. Now, as for the two of you, it's a little touch and go, so I need a bit of time with him to prepare him. We are sliding down toward a deep part of shit, mate. Very deep shit. That silk they've got's got his nose into everything. Those phone taps. Are they legal? For Christ's sake, it's part of normal procedure, you twit. That priest has disappeared. Even I can't find him. But when he does show, we'll have to be there. And it'll take more than a shot in the foot. The Abbey. Kali, Kali. Hello. Oh, it's me, Dickens. Yeah, I'm listening, I'm listening. You know those seats in Valley Park? I will not allow you to lower the tenor of this court. Oh, I saw him. It was definitely him. He's got that stubby, bobby accent. No, then what does he do? He shoots him in the foot and then he shoots him in the head. He didn't have a chance. Your Honor, I'm finished with this witness. Thank you. The defense rests. <laughs> Miss Richards, you may step down. <laughs> Now, your final submissions, gentlemen. An inquiry has revealed that Mr. Clark, otherwise known as Hercules, was a sapper in the British Army with the rank of Lieutenant. An explosive specialist with the rank of Lieutenant would clearly have become quite proficient at his job, I would have thought. In contrast, my client shows no sign of any expertise with explosives. And should one read the report set up by the bomb squad, it clearly stipulates, we discover that the perpetrator went about the task with a high degree of knowledge of the business. Therefore, for these reasons, I submit that the evidence before the court raises sufficient doubt. If I may say, Your Honor, this situation reeks of a conspiracy to pervert the course of justice indeed. And in my view, my client need no further investigation, but that there be further investigation of other parties, specifically investigations by the police internal affairs. Those are my submissions, Your Honor. Thank you, Mr. Illingworth. It's becoming progressively apparent that the evidence placed before the court indicates I cannot say with any certainty that the offense has been proven against the accused. I therefore have no option, apart from your community service order, but to dismiss the case. Mr. Cola, you may go free. Yes. <laughs> 
So, is this our last time? How would I know? <laughs> These last few weeks. What a ride, huh? <laughs> yeah. I want to keep going. With you. He's going to be sitting right there tonight. I don't want to lose you. Oh, shit. What a mess. Oh, it's good to see you, Dad. What a relief, huh? Well, it's not over yet, not until I put those bums away. So, look, thanks, mate. Thanks for everything. Yeah, here, give us that. Where's George? Ah, she's at home, cooking a special meal for tonight. Keep it jumpy, something. Something the matter? Ah, uh, nah, nah. Hey, I made my money back, so that's cool, huh? Yeah, she was awesome in that second round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, uh, I made more than my money back. So I could lend you some. No, I don't need... I'll be okay. You look a bit jumpy, Dad. Something the matter? I was um, looking forward to seeing my girl. Yeah. Yeah, well, first, a little surprise. Coming in too, aren't you? Nah, nah, this is your gig. I'm gonna head home, get dinner ready. Have a good time, okay? You just relax. 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 You want me to relax? We don't need this. Yeah, I know we don't need this. This is doing my head in. Still your first one. Something's going on. Yeah, something's going on, all right. I'm trying to keep sober, you silly buggers. Bit of a face is to tell a story. Bit of bike bullet, eh? Hey, I'll drive you.
Hey, congratulations in order. I think they let you out. Steve, don't. Making a run for it, are we? Come on. I mean, I didn't mean to set you up. I mean, it's a spare of the moment thing. You're all right, all right, all right. You might have been right about the gun. But I mean, you know, I dumped you in it. I mean, who wouldn't, just to save their own skin? He's not worth it! Go on, get out of it! He's not worth it, is he? You're really gonna love you inside. Get out of here! The young girl's waiting for you. Besides your son, you remember him? You wanna go back inside for assault? Well, do ya? Go on. Total cocker. I mean, we all make mistakes. You know, I can take my punishment, you'll see. But trust me, trust me. Got yourself in a bit of trouble again, I eh, heard. Damn it, button. Why are you using that after all I've taught you? Can't you speak properly? Cops are looking for you, you better hide. Cops? Oh, what the bloody hell do you expect me to hide? Well, in there. I can't go in there, it's dingy. Well, that ought to help you. Oh, well, right, you let me know when it's safe to come out, though. Does this go somewhere? Oh! oh. oh. Straight to jail, bastard. You biffed him, didn't you? <laughs> Would I do something like that? What do you know of this? Perk was hiding it. What is it? Fuck if I know. It's locked. But wait a minute. Perk was hiding it. Yeah. Diamonds! Diamonds? Half a million dollars worth. Well, what do you reckon? Am I an honest man or a crim? No, you, uh... You drop these off to the cop shop. Hey? I have something more important to do with. You sure? Money can't buy you love. So, come on. Put your foot down, let's get this heap out of here. Come on. this home. Hey. I thought we were going to have those meatballs with a special sauce you like. Yeah, well, why not? George has cooked this. And what's that? Gutsy casserole. Oh, I could do with a bit of that. Yeah, I reckon we all could. <laughs> well, uh, you see, Dad. I tell you that uh, I know what's been going on. Well, the cat's away, the mice will. No! Don't you dare say that! Okay, that's not how it happened. Things, they just don't work like that. Look, Steve, it was unexpected. 
You brought your son up to be a caring guy and he is. We lost you. But we kept going because we didn't want to throw it all away. Look, getting involved was the last thing we thought would happen. Look, it happens, Dad. Look, we feel as bad as you'd want us to feel. He's gonna come out of there like a raging bull. Oh shit. Sit down, young lady. Okay, oh, look. Guys, guys, just be cool, okay? Relax. I've been dragging you through shit all these years. I don't want that anymore. This is your night, this is your house, this is your woman. It's time to let nature run its course. So. Dad, is it? No, no, uh, I'll let uh, you, you two celebrate uh, while you can. Come on, hang on, don't. No, no, I've got plans, I've got plans. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll see you both at the, the gym next week, right? Yeah, uh, she'll be there. Yeah, of course. And you? Yeah, yeah I'll drop in for a bit. All right, um, well, um, I'll see you later. What, was my casserole that bad? No. So, Monday, it'll be a chance to see more of my boy. Look, at least stay for dinner. No, no, I'll, I'll do my own thing. I'll grab a curry down the road. Where would you grab a curry this time of night? And, uh, thank you for reminding me I'm still alive. You're very welcome. Hey, um... Look, I can drive you, it's... No, no, uh, I haven't got far to go, mate. I haven't got far to go. I'm proud of you. Proud of both of you. Hey, Dad? Dad! Go on. Tell him. Get it out. I love you. You silly old bastard. Father, I had to say something. Do you think he heard me? For the first time to speak my mind. Something I had to do You always were a tower Working on your plan but Then you had to step back So I could step up And be the man I am Remember when you said I was troubled and despair I was just trying to do my thing But you were everywhere You know I really thought I Could handle any fall But you'd step in where I had been And I'd learn nothing at all Shadows on the floor Shadows on the wall Doubts that weigh my heart 
Living with the sound of a battleground Oh, shadows from the past Through the give and take And in spite of the wars Those doubts turn to survival In the way and when the time was spent And I became the rival Father, I had to say some things to you Yeah, it looked like things had gone wrong There was nothing we could do You know now, I never thought how The fight becomes survival Now I reveal I no longer 